I've been this way my entire life, you know. And I've always said, you know, oh, I got an old soul. Like, even in high school, I had... Or no, like, right after high school and I got my first apartment, I had vinyl everywhere. Like, I used to even plaster it along the walls and stuff. Like, I, I loved vinyl. People would make fun of me. You know, at CDs that came out. They're like, what the hell, why would you want a vinyl? I'm like, I don't know, man. Just, like, something about it. Like, it, it's like the whole process. Here, I'm, I'm, I'm going to give you guys a little rundown. Okay, so, there are certain things in life that just are. They are what they are. They exist because they exist. Uh, you know, they are, it just is the way it is because of the way it is. You know, not everything has to have a finite explanation of exactly why or what or how. They just don't. They, they, so when you say, like, my, my favorite flavor of popsicle is orange. Well, why is it orange? Because it fucking is, you know? Like, things, sometimes things are just what they are, right? So, when people ask me why I like vinyl, well, I, I might add the word so much. Why, why I like it so much. Because I really do. I, I love it. It's just one of those things. I don't have an answer for them. And so then they give me that, like, hipster thing like oh you're just being a hipster or something you know or like you're just trying to relive so you know they, they put a, a meaning behind it but the, but it's just one of those things man like I can explain you know kind of why I like it why I like it so much I don't fucking know man I just do there's just something about holding holding a vinyl like hold on Like this right here, right? This is my favorite Steely Dan album, which is my favorite band, okay? So yeah, I can sit there and go on YouTube, Pandora, whatever you want to, you know, sound fuck, I don't know. You can go to any of those sites and apps, type in Steely Dan Asia and listen to it. I get that, right? I get it. But there's just like, there's no soul to that, you know? Because you're doing, like, the same thing for everything. And then it's the same shit for, like, every... It's just, like, point and click. Tap, tap, tap. Eh. But there's there's something to it. There's something to holding something that that band made. Like, like the band made this shit. Right? And then there's something about taking out this beautiful black sphere... Well, it's not sphere, it's more of a circle, right? And then there's something about taking care of it. You have to take care of vinyls. You have, you, have to, you have to clean them, you have to dust them. You have to put them in protective stuff. Like, I got the insert in here. I, got, I, I buy fresh new sleeves for all my vinyl. And see, I keep them in perfect, pristine condition. Now see, it, it's not made of glass. It's not made of glass. It's not going to ruin it to touch it. Let's put that to shit. You see those people like, oh my god, <laughs> all the all these kids who don't know what the fuck they're talking about, dude. Favorite vinyl, mint condition. See, look, ah, oh. you can even lick the son of a bitch. I'm just saying, it's not a piece of glass, guys. Chill out. But you know, there's something to holding this, and then then there's something to like putting it. In its place, the one like you have one spot in your house dedicated to just that. Think about that for a second. It's not just a computer screen that you do a thousand things on, but no, just one one spot, one physical square space. You put it on. Mine, you just hit the play button and it just goes. But you know, you grab the needle, you put it in, you hit the play button, you hear that that engagement of the senses you know you just know that first notes coming up and then you listen to it and then as you're listening to it you have no control over it you can't skip you can't fast forward you can't pause you can't nothing you just hit play and it fucking plays it's like being at a concert you know you can't tell them what to play 
and stop. I mean, you, you physically can pick a needle and push it. I'm just saying, though, you put it in, you hit the fucking play button, you go to what you're doing, you know, you talk to your friends, whatever. See? So you have to listen to everything that, the, that those artists put together. Like, you can't just play what you like or make a mix album or something. No, you gotta listen to it all. The whole, the whole deal. And then you gotta get halfway through, get up, flip it over, aim your needle, hit play again. Same thing. See? So the So you listen to like the the entire work of art, you know, and you appreciate it. You have to. Especially if you like like one of the last songs or something. You know, sometimes you'll like just side B or maybe the A side is, you know, the better one or whatever. But like those were your only choices. And it made you respect and appreciate the music more. It really did. Because, like, this is a lot of physical effort. You got, First off, you just got to dig through them. It's not like you just type the letter, you know, S for Steely Dan and just goes... And they, like, hover out of the things. No, they're in fucking milk crates, man. They're just on milk crates on the ground. And you got to flip, 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 flip. Oh, there, there it is. And then you take it out. Then you got to take it out of this. And you got to put it on there. It, you know? So it, you have to put in effort. And that really makes you appreciate them what you listen to just even that much more because you have to put in that kind of effort it's the same reason why everyone's fat because they don't even want to put in the effort to making their own food because that's how much effort it would take and fuck that I'd, I'd rather just kill myself in my body slowly because I'm too lazy so I get the mentality because that's where it stems from is that kind of shit just that lazy American mentality but to me, it's like, it's an event, you know, like an event. It's not just, what do you want to listen to? And then forget about it. Like, no, you got to like search for it. Fuck with it. You know, listen to the whole thing. Like, and just all of it. It's, it's just like a ritual. Like, you know, you go to like church and they, they say, you know, you kneel down, you say this bunch of shit, then you stand up, you do this, then you, you stand in line, you get this like bread wafer and then you close it out with a song you know like it's a ritual it's a fucking ritual man and it's just something i really enjoy and i can't tell you why but i've, re I've recognized that that is the reason because i don't know to me it's just like a little ritual and then the music just kind of so i started going because of this song playing i don't know there's just something to it's more to music that's my point it's more than music an experience. See, now I gotta flip through them and find where my Steely Dan is, which it's only the second one in. But just adding to my point. And this is a good sign. Mario. We need to play some Mario.